Good morning. Today is October the 30th of 2019, and I am Dr. Miguel Carlos Riella. I'm editor-in-chief of the Brazilian Journal of Nephrology, and this year we are celebrating the 40th anniversary of the Brazilian Journal of Nephrology. That was started by our first editor, Dr. José Augusto Barbosa de Guiar from Rio de Janeiro. Since then, we have had eminent nephrologists who continue this work of keeping the Brazilian Journal of Nephrology active without missing any editions. I must highlight the work of previous editors, Cesar Costa, Emil Sabaga, José Francisco Figueiredo, Horacio Eisen, and more recently, the colleagues Décio Mion, João Egidio Romão, Josemir Lugon, and Marcos Gomes Bastos. Well, I would like to tell you some of our work uh, that started in 2015 under the leadership of Dr. Carmen Santos, then president of the Brazilian Society of Nephrology. Our goal sought to improve, internationalize our journal to that, uh, so that the scientific production of Brazilian nephrology would have more international visibility. Of course, an extremely important step taken by our predecessor, Dr. Marcos Bastos, was to insert our journal into the National Library of Medicine, Medline. From then on, we started to have an international dissemination and exhibition of the scientific production of Brazilian nephrology. And our purpose since the beginning of our management in 2015 was to broaden this purpose of internationalizing the journal and improving its quality. One of the first actions was to change the name of the journal from Jornal Brasileiro de Nephrologia to Brazilian Journal of Nephrology, and we now have the printed form of the journal in English. We have established an agreement with Cielo, which is a platform that brings together the main scientific journals from Latin America and even from other countries such as Portugal, Spain, to generate and revise the manuscripts and deliver their PDFs. We also have adopted Scholar One, a manuscript insertion platform that is adopted by some of the best journals in the world. We have also revamped our site, which is now in English and Portuguese, and manuscripts are also available in both languages. We have also adopted the publication Ahead of Print. That is, the article once accepted and revised, it is immediately made available by Cielo on our website and on Medline. This way, we greatly shorten the period in which the manuscript is submitted and the time it is made available on Medline and other media. The Brazilian Journal of Nephrology also on PubMed Central and Scopus, and this year we have submitted all the necessary documentation for Web of Science, which is, I would say, the last step in this process for the journal to have an impact factor in the future. We also reformulated the journal's layout, and today we can see on the cover the main articles, topics published in the journal. We have also hired new Portuguese and English reviewers and intend to include a biostatistic in the future to analyze the statistical methodology of the article and also serve as a reference to assist our uh, society members. We have also expanded our editorial board, and today we have over 30% of international colleagues. We have recently introduced visual abstracts, which can be viewed on our site alongside the original article. In fact, there are graphic posters that allow a quick reading of the methodology, results, and conclusions of the article. We also created a visual abstract in social media editor's section to promote the journal's publication through Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. For these new sections, we have the collaboration of several young nephrologists from Brazil. And where are we going? What are our future plans? By being accepted into the web of science in the near future and having an impact factor like other leading nephrology journals, I believe we need to sensitize the Brazilian nephrologists to honor our journal by submitting their best articles. As one of the few nephrology journals in Latin America and Central America indexed in the National Library of Medicine, we already appreciate our improvement by receiving several manuscripts from our Latin American colleagues, and even from countries such as the United States, Portugal, Turkey, Iran, India, and others. Revision of manuscripts is crucial to raising the standard of our journal. Here, I reiterate the invitation to our colleagues to accept revising the manuscripts when requested. 
Personally, I would like to say that it has been gratifying to contribute to the enhancement of our journal and consequently of nephrology in Brazil. Thank you.